Hello Germany, it's me NYSE Einstein from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. It looks like I combed my hair with a firecracker today. It's because this market is just topsy-turvy. It's all over the place, up 200, down 200, for good reason, in every possible way. Okay, today, the day, it was all about the Fed. I don't have much time. I got to go pick up my daughter at college. I don't have time on my phone. I got to reset it so I can be back to you with a good three to four minutes on a daily basis. But for today, it was all about the Fed. Okay, there was morning chatter this morning. Market opened up kind of weak, a little bit down, blah, blah, blah. And then it was chatter. Two of the Fed presidents from around the country started bringing up the fact that since GDP numbers have risen, since the economy seems a little more healthy, since the reforecast of the, the, of, of the beginning of April was a bit better, retail sales and whatnot, that the economy was healthy enough to sustain a raise in interest rates. And that started breaking the market down. As we know, when that's the case, they love to sell the market. They get out of that and, they get out of that and into more solid investments like gold up $6, oil up breaking through new highs over Goldman's call yesterday. I didn't get to talk to you yesterday. Yesterday was a majorly significant day because Goldman Sachs made a huge bullish call, which was a reversal of their uh, former posture on oil. That was a significant thing, okay? So then around two o'clock, this market just started falling off. It turned out that there was some chatter. Lockhart in Atlanta, one of the most dovish of the presidents, also changed his whole posture and said that we will be raising interest rates soon. He didn't say June. It rhymes with soon. June rhymes with soon, but it doesn't matter. Interest rate raise causes a sell-off in the market. People getting out of that into harder assets. That made the market sell off radically. We're down 220 points. We ended up closing off 180. It was a bit of a bounce near the end. People covering that short because there was enough time with people who were trading this market on a daily basis to know that Fed chatter about an interest raise sooner than later is a good short opposite short opportunity okay a little bit of cover on the close market closed down 180 this is significant this is significant how long term this sell-off will last i don't know it's one of these chatter things it's one of these you know people are reading the news there's there's twitter feeds there's there's all this the the the, the trails of communication that go out there okay the channels that people read news on and people react on a daily basis, whether it's robots or whatnot. Anyway, NYSE out. I'll talk to you tomorrow. I am back. Big sell-off today. All about the Fed. All about the Fed. It's all about the Fed. Love you all later.